as we continue to reflect during the season of Lent, I can't help but be reminded of the story when, when Jesus was going to bring about change to, to not just Jerusalem, not just the whole Middle East, but the entire world. He was planning to enter Jerusalem for his crucifixion. And the first event that kept um, sort of in my memory in a very special place is the scene when, when Jesus, right before Jesus is going to enter Jerusalem, uh, he told the disciples, the two of them specifically, to enter, to find uh, a donkey that has already been tied and ready, uh, has some, a donkey that has never been written, ridden and is ready for use. And if, the, if you see the owner, Jesus told the two disciples, simply say that the Lord needs it. And I don't know about you, if, I'm, if I was a disciple, um, I would be very sort of freaking out a little bit because that's a little far-fetched. You, what if people think I'm stealing donkey? What if there are no reassurance and being a very controlling person and everything has to be confirmed? Um, that's a little bit heart-wrenching for me. But during this time, uh, the story in Luke chapter 19, um, it reminded me of something very important. It reminded me that... that what is God, you know, just like the disciples really listening to the Lord to, to obey and put His word at utmost priority. How are we, maybe during this week, um, how are we listening to the Holy Spirit? How are we listening to the Lord? Uh, maybe this week, um, that maybe God, maybe God is tugging your heart to, to maybe be more restful. Maybe the Lord right now as He is talking to you and, and and telling you maybe to give financial assistance to those who friends around you that 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 have been laid off. Maybe as a neighbor that you could drop off a care package, or maybe simply waking up early and spending the time. But the question that I learn from my devotion is: keep asking, God, what are you saying? God, what is my next faithful step? God. How am I in my life right now to bring change? And as you think about it, may you be encouraged. May you ask the Lord if He needs it.